Hydro seeding is an efficient seed planting method that involves spraying a combination of seed, mulch, water, and fertilizer from tanks over a large area. While generally done by industry professionals, it's possible to learn how to hydro seed yourself to help expand your landscaping business. It's important to use a hydro seeder properly. A successful project involves five key steps. Finding the right hydro seeder for your business, preparing the ground, properly mixing the seed and materials, using the hydro seeder, caring for the seed after installation. Step one, finding a hydro seeder. There are quite a few options when it comes to the size and type of hydro seeders available. We offer several different machines that are capable of handling everything from addressing patchiness or brown spots in an existing lawn to seeding medium or large-sized residential or commercial properties. It is important to consider the type of project you'll be working on when deciding which hydro seeder is right for you. Know what kind of seed mix will work for your area and project. Suppliers can generally provide direction, but it helps to do your research. Step 2. Preparation Ground preparation is incredibly important because it's ultimately responsible for how well your lawn takes root. To achieve the best results, it's crucial that the ground be level and smooth with loose soil that's free of debris such as rocks, sticks, or weeds. Raking where possible provides the best environment for seeds to establish. Don't rush this process. Unprepared ground will lead to inferior results. Step 3. Mixing The best hydro seed mixture or slurry includes seed, water, mulch, tackifiers, and fertilizer. Herbicides or additives can be included as needed. Mixing the hydro seed is crucial. Read product instructions and ask for information when purchasing. This ensures you get the right materials and use the proper proportions so you won't need to restock midway through. Jet agitation systems are very easy to use because there are minimal moving parts or controls to contend with. You simply check fuel and engine oil levels, fill the tank about two-thirds of the way with water, and then start the engine to allow it to warm up. As a direct drive system, once the engine is on, the pump is agitating, and clean water can cycle through before other hydro seed materials are added to help reduce the risk of clogs. Once you've made sure the jets are running properly, moving the water around, you can begin to load your materials. A good rule of thumb is to add your materials from lightest to heaviest. The tackifier first, followed by the seed, then fertilizer, and mulch. Top off with water and allow the slurry to mix for 10 to 15 minutes. The slurry should be uniform, without large clumps. You are now ready to spray. Step 4. Applying Hydro Seed One of the keys to a great-looking hydro-seeded lawn is even application. Reliably successful results can be achieved, provided the mix is correct and the seed is properly cared for after application. For best results, overlap spray patterns to have nice, even coverage. Step 5. Caring for Hydro Seed After Installation What happens directly after Hydro Seed is applied can make or break the success of any lawn project. It's very important for the seeds to stay moist and that foot traffic is prevented in the area to help seeds germinate and take root. Make sure customers are aware of this and have sprinkler systems set up to automatically water the area if possible or that they have a way to water the area frequently either via hose or sprinkler. With proper knowledge of correct mixes, application, and aftercare, hydro seeding can be a rewarding process that can allow you to give customers a healthy green lawn for years to come. Easy Lawn, the easy way to expand your landscaping business.